aprons on my website is going to be seven dollars seven dollars okay so any color apron you want can be seven dollars yeah get involved with that it's mother's day it's coming up you could get her red one you could get her orange one i have girl color girly colors i have boy colors unisex whatever you call it yes get her apron seven dollar aprons okay what's up my p b p c it's your girl Daisy. i'm back with the video and this video today is gonna be a mukbang and y'all when i say this is literally making something out of nothing because i have no idea what this is but before we get into the video i am going to tell you guys what i if i remember exactly everything i put in here i don't know what to name this this is probably gonna be like cheesy pasta or something but anyways so you guys remember that butter sauce i had you guys know i'm good to turn my butter sauce into a freaking pasta okay so what i did was i chopped up some more onions and garlic and freaking mind you the butter sauce already has sweet peppers in it so it's ziti noodles with onions garlic pepper no onions garlic sweet peppers it's Italian sausage in here. And mind you, the reason why I made this pasta in the first place because I saw the ziti noodles and I saw the Italian sausage. I said, damn, what should I make with that? I said, you know what, let me throw some chicken in there. Because I needed something that was going to be quick. And I was at first I was thinking shrimp, then I was like, nah, shrimp not going to go. So then freaking what I did was boil the noodles and I made the chicken and the sausage. And then I put the butter sauce in my, um, my pot. Made that hot, dumped the chicken in there, dumped the pasta in there, seasoned that thing up. Then I added some cheese. So yeah, that's what we have today, y'all. That's what we eating. <laughs> I'm telling you, and I just been so quick because man, is he sleeping? So I don't know what. The, oh, and there's a jalapeno in here, y'all. I'm scared. I got my water though, just in case it's a little salty. This thing is piping hot. But yeah, how are you guys doing today? Did you guys miss me? Hmm, taste my experiment. Now you guys know with my PB Potion Butter Sauce, I usually like to freaking put it with Alfredo and it makes it like a scampy, not Alfredo, yeah, make, makes it Alfredo, like add heavy cream and stuff like that. And it makes it like a scampy, it's so good. So with this one, I was like, you know what? It's more like a hearty flavor, so let me just add some cheese to it. Ooh. Now, let's see. Hopefully it's not salty. spicy ooh. this tastes with the ooh, it's spicy <laughs> if you guys are interested in a coldest water bottle you guys use my coupon code punky it's p-u-n-k-y for some coins at for some coins off at checkout ooh it's spicy mm. I added some chili oil. Mm. This tastes good. Come through, mother. I can't wait till I start making majesty of um a dinner out of what we we got food in the house. This is that this is the we got food in the house meal. <laughs> wow. I don't know why I was so scared. Not really scared, but I just didn't know what it was gonna taste like. Yeah, I see the cheat. This thing is like a little. It's trying to taste like. You guys know how Rasta Pasta got that kick like that. Oh, I can explain that. Mm. 
Mm. All right. I'm going to stop mm, because I know some of y'all hate that. But this right here, I kid you no lie, it's hitting. It is hitting, y'all. When I check, because look, if I'm someone that's going to be spending money on a butter store. Oh, no, I want to make a mess. Y'all wanted that. <laughs> but if I'm going to be spending money on the butter store, I want to be able to use it for different things. Mm. It's like creamy from the cheese. I use mozzarella cheese and I use um Velveeta cheese. I make a block. I said, what am I doing? Every every time I was cooking, I mean the whole time I was cooking, I said, what the fuck am I doing? I said, am I really about to record this? I said, fuck it, I'm hungry. Majesty sleeping. I could either put my laundry clothes away or freaking get them up on my guys. And then I was going freaking. Mm, I was going to order something on Uber Eats. I'm like, by the time Uber Eats come, my food would have been done. Like, this literally took me like. 10 minutes. Literally 10 minutes. Literally 10 minutes to boil these noodles, make my chicken and my um sausage and just dump everything together and start throwing in my seasoning, throwing in my cheese. That's good. I'm telling y'all. I wish a bar. <sighs> I wish a bar. And if this is what I had in my house. Mm. It's so good and it's spicy. From that chili oil. Mm. Smells spicy, but it's like a like even my nose is kind of like you know. I'm starting to feel like it's about to start running, but it's still like, ooh. I'm excited. And I've been wanting to for the longest time to start like cooking with different things. Like, like don't get me wrong. Like with my butter sauces and stuff like that, I don't cook like I don't make my regular food taste like my butter sauces. You get what I'm saying? Like, I try to like make my butter sauces my butter sauces, and then like when I cook, I cook it. I cook differently. Like I can't explain what I'm trying to say, but. I try new things with my buddy sources because I want it to be like something a different flavor from when I'm eating my seafood than when I'm eating my like chicken or anything. So I felt like with my regular food, my food kept kind of tasting the same. And I'm like, is it because I'm cooking stuff that's in like the same family? Like I'll make different things like sometimes my steak and my lamb chops will taste the same. Like, that's whack. Or like, like, shipments, I make a pork chop. But I don't put flour on my pork chop. Like me, sometimes I don't really like flour on my pork chop. That's that Spanish shit. But, um, <laughs> But nah, sometimes I do put flour on my pork chop. Just so like, if I say I want to fry pork chop, give it to me fried. Like don't put it in oil and fry it and call it fried and there's no flour on there. That's how I think sometimes. 
But and even some like when I cook for Bert, most of the time that's the only re re reason why I really would cook is if I'm cooking for Bert. So I, if he say he want fried pork chop, I'm gonna fry it with flour. But anyways, yeah, like so sometimes even my pork chops start tasting like my steak, and it's because I think like I be putting the same season as on everything, but I be doing it so differently. But sometimes. It all tastes the same. Mmm. It's real cheesy with right him. Let me get a piece of chicken with that. This is good. I wouldn't even call this like a mac and cheese either because it's not. It's good. It's good. I'm happy. Ooh. It's Italian sausage. It was left over from when I made my spaghetti. And I'm like, I'm not about to waste this. So, I'm telling you, that's, that's some shit my mother would have did too. Definitely something my mother would have did. She would have freaking, my mother was good for a noodle with some butter and garlic and pepper and call it a day. She was definitely good for that. As a side, Like, as a lazy now. Like, she's gonna make a protein. She's gonna make a protein. Like, um... Like, uh... What was my mom? Like, she's gonna make a baked chicken. And... Same place that she ain't want no rice or nothing. She was good to make her some... Butter garlic noodles. <laughs> yeah. I ain't got a friend for nobody. This was really a... Uh, I don't know what the hell I'm about to eat. I wasn't even going to record this. But Majesty was sleeping. I'm like, nah. And y'all know Bird's birthday's coming up. I spent mad freaking money. And it's not even here yet. So I just know, like... I just... Well, I did spend mad money. <laughs> I really did, because now that I think about it, it's like, he just been lucking up out of me, like, for a freaking, since Christmas, right? What was the holiday before Christmas? Nothing. Oh, I bought him something just because. Mm. Hey, November. Not like I'm not like trying to like brag or anything. I'm not gonna say exactly what I got him. But before Christmas I freaking got him some shoes. That was really expensive. Only because I'm that person that if you buy me something, I feel like I gotta buy you something. And it was like, it was, oh, matter of fact, it was at, um, for our gender reveal, he had brought me a bag. And I was just like, oh, how sweet. So I brought him some shoes. And I feel like it's never 50 50 because niggas is expensive. I don't give a fuck what you say. Guys is way more money than girls, but. Yeah, so I have ended up buying some shoes. And then um after that it was Christmas. I got him Christmas gifts. Not include like not including that one of the gifts was a trip. <laughs> one of the gifts was a trip to Mexico. And then it was our anniversary and then I was buying so much okay, so it was November, which was uh because our general was November eighth. Or the fourth, one of them says. So I brought him something then, then Christmas. 
I brought him the trip and some gifts. Our anniversary, I brought, um, I spent mad money on excursions and his gift. Valentine's Day, got him more gifts. Now it's his freaking birthday, more gifts. More gifts. But you know what, it's fine. Cause Mother's Day is coming up. You dig me? Mother's Day is definitely coming up. And you know what's crazy? I don't want to celebrate Mother's Day at all. At all. But everybody's just trying to put me in a mood to like celebrate Mother's Day. Like for myself. And I'm going I'm to try. I'm going to try to like, you know, enjoy being, enjoy Mother's Day for myself. Like I'm going to try. Literally, I'm really going to try. Like, emphasize on try. Carly. I could get in one of those moods where it sucks. Like, <laughs> really, y'all. Um, I don't even know what Mother's Day is. But, I'm going to try. I wonder what this is going to taste like after it's reheated. This is so good. I, can't, I want Bert to try it. Like, you know, like, some things is, like, for self. Like, you won't feed this to nobody, but I think Bert would like this, too. Where's the chicken at? But, yeah, after his birthday, ain't no more holidays for him until, what, Christmas? Period. Oh, Father's Day. Oh, my God. When's Father's Day? I don't like Father's Day either. Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't, I'm, I'm going to try not to be a Debbie Downer on Mother's Day and Father's Day. Because that's not my vibe anyway. To be honest, I don't get to shit like that. Even when, like, if I wasn't a mother... And I don't like Mother's Day. I never, like, try to, like, bring that energy on anywhere, anybody. I just be chilling to myself. But, damn. The fuck? I don't know what he getting for Father's Day, to be honest. I don't even know what Father's Day is. But, it depends on what he give me on Mother's Day. No Tino Shay, because I'm a good gifter. And, Bert... He's okay. He's okay. I appreciate everything. But I feel like Father's Day is one of those holidays where it's now that's just driving it. But yeah, I'm broke. Freaking, I'm someone who will always say, oh, I'm broke, like, joking and stuff like that. Like how I did just now. But I'm really trying not to joke like that anymore. Because in reality, I'm not broke. Like, you know? <laughs> and people say, like, when you put that energy or those words in the air, you start to believe it. So I try not to think like that or, like, like joke like that. But that's really my favorite line. I am broke, bro. I got bills. I got bills and a baby. I cannot come. Sorry. <laughs> that is my specialty. Y'all, I'm so... I think... Well, I know I'm allergic to shit like this, but it's really hurting my shoulders. After this, I'm about to get undressed. It's 4.20. How many y'all getting high? <laughs> It's 420. Yeah. I'm not, but I'm just asking for y'all. Um, it's nice outside. I ain't got shit to do. But watch the baby. Now I was gonna take him for a little walk, a little stroll, but he's tired. I don't know. When he's sleepy, I let him sleep. Like, come on. Babies is already like got a lot on their plate for being a baby. 
especially when you're a preemie baby because if y'all know when your baby's in a NICU they tell you like how much energy it takes out of the babies when you um gotta feed them and stuff like that so I'm just like if he's tired I'll let him sleep this is big onion uh-uh another one but I'll, I'll eat this one that one no too big Ooh. This is really good. This is that if I call Bert and tell me I made pasta and he said we'll call, I'm gonna say I don't know. Italian sausage, chicken. Cheese, raw, um, not raw, chopped onion, chopped garlic, chili sauce, but to give that, give it that spice, sweet peppers, and then add your own seasonings, y'all, and some butter. You rock this. This shit is good. It's a little heavy though, so if you was making this for a family, y'all be good. It's definitely a little heavy though. But Bro, it was not doing nothing else. Well my window is open. I can't watch louder. Oh wow. I don't even know what to call this video. I might just name it Making Pasta for My Butter Sauce. Or, what the is this? Yeah, I be bugging. I be thinking I hear him, and I go check on him. He be sleep. <laughs> How many of you guys do that <clears throat> when you have a baby? When you like, it's like it's programmed in my brain to hear, like hear him. So to where I start like thinking I hear him, but I really don't. It's just like in the back of my head. This video is long overdue. I mean, like <laughs> it's done. It's done. This is good though. I don't want to stop eating it. So this one is for Bert. It's for 20 for him. I know you don't want to eat some money at home. And this is what I'm I'm serving. Take it or leave it. You gonna fuck this up though. Bird likes spice, that's why. He likes spice. Y'all can't put, put this shit down, right? I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. This is good. That was good. I enjoyed that. This is better than anything I would go order from Uber Eats. No tea, no shade. know what I would order. Probably Chinese food or even Papa. I don't know. I don't know what I would order just now. And you know what I realized? I don't like ramen. Like, not like oodles and noodles. I fuck with oodles and noodles. I fuck with um ramen that I can make myself in the house. But like, you know, like, oh, I gotta stop watching Mikey Chan. 
because he be making that shit look so freaking good and i don't know if it's because the last time i had it i was pregnant and i threw it up that i can't even um imagine the thought of eating that shit like oh anything like, while i was pregnant or that I ate when I was in the midst of, like, you know, of that sick face. And you guys know, my whole pregnancy, I was good until freaking... I was good until, like, um... Is my seat shaking? This is so close to the table today. But, um, I was good in my whole pregnancy until, um... Until January. So, anything that I was, like... Like, even, like, that stuff that Bert had. Like, Shake Shack... Like the Korean style chickens, ugh. all that shit. Mm -mm. But I want to try it now that I'm not um pregnant. But I just the thought of it makes me a little nauseous, to be honest. So yeah, I didn't vlog at all this week. It's Tuesday. <laughs> I, gotta, I don't want to, like, you know, put myself down or anything. I probably vlog tomorrow. I really haven't been doing anything but getting all these butters out. And I'm like, I know y'all don't want to keep seeing that. That's right. But, uh, yeah, I need to, I want to vlog. I want to put out a vlog at least once a week. Um, so, tomorrow I'm going to get a wax. Now, I didn't want to keep, um, the only thing I've been doing was making butters. Making butters, um, and shopping for Bert. So, it was like, I don't, I can't even show y'all me shopping for Bert because I don't want Bert to freaking know what I got him. That's why. So, this week was a bad vlog week, but I know tomorrow I'm going to get a wax. Um, I kind of want to freaking organize my closet like throw away everything i can't fit like my pants the thigh area not squeezing into that if i want to do that i really want to get that in the video i gotta do my hair for Bert's birthday i know i'm supposed to be using this flat iron in the video oh my goodness that's the one goal to do but it's, i'm not even flat ironing the hair I don't even feel like putting on a wig. But Bert, love a, um, a long bundle piece. Yes. He's gonna be sweating. Whose birthday is it? Me and his. But now I'm gonna do my hair. I might do, I'm gonna definitely do my nails and my toes over because this not going with the dress that I got for Bert's birthday. Um, that's what And then I probably will vlog us going now on Bert's birthday. But then after that, I don't know. But I'm not doing nothing this week because I could. I I just know Bert is gonna want to go out for his birthday. It's his birthday weekend. He say he don't know and he not go. Well, he's lying. I hate when he lie like that. But he's definitely going out. So I know I'm not gonna be doing nothing like that unless I go to the city with the baby. But I don't. I don't think I want to. Honestly. I don't think I want to. It depends on the weather. If it's really nice, then I'm gonna vlog and take Majesty to the city. And by that time, y'all will already see the um the baby pictures. Yo, freaking adorable. So yeah, that's really it. I'm out of here, y'all. <clears throat> I did my um, I did my little job, my little work for the day. Sure, from early too. I was so tired. I'm just really trying to like get you guys butters out and a timely matter. Cause I it's so many people that I complain when it's like takes like too long. But I feel like a lot of people don't understand that this is not like a something that's already made, you know? It's not like you order I could just package your stuff and then ship it out in the morning. Like I would really like have to like make your shit fresh, like you know? And then it's, it's you and then other customers. I mean, that's that's not your problem, but you know what I'm saying? I try to um, ship it out quickly. I think I might even have a sale. <clears throat> Fuck it, right? Yeah, I'm going to sale or not. 
Matter of fact, I should do a sale. All the aprons. All right. All right. <laughs> Yeah, all the aprons on my website is going to be $7. $7, okay? So any color apron you want can be $7. Yeah, get involved with that. It's Mother's Day coming up. You could get her a red one. You could get her an orange one. I have girl color, girly colors. I have boy colors, unisex, whatever you call it. Yes, get her apron, seven dollar aprons. Okay, do that. No code needed. I'm gonna have to put that in the front. <laughs> I'm gonna have to put that in the front of the video. No code needed. Seven dollar aprons. The link and stuff will be in the description box below. And yeah. I love having sales. I love having sales because y'all yeah, love ha when I have sales. And then I love when people have sales too. So it's like, oh shit, it's lit. So yeah, $7 aprons. Get involved with that. And they great quality. That's why, I, and you know what's crazy? I've been fucking up because I haven't even been wearing my aprons in my cooking video. But I mean, it's only two. But my next one, comment down below to remind me, wear your apron next cooking video. I got y'all. The quality is amazing. Like, and I was just like, wow, I did that. I did that. Because it was so hard even trying to make those aprons. Because everybody was like, oh, what's your type of logo? It can't, it's not for a printout, right? And I'm like, miss, send me some samples, please. Because how? Yes, it is. And I actually really do like the way it looks printed on. So, yeah, y'all. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you guys like mukbangs. Comment down below what other videos you guys want to see from me. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell so you guys are notified every time I do post. I do post daily uploads at 4 p.m. Eastern time. And yeah. Since the aprons is already like, you know, come to, is, I'm going to ship it. It's not like I got to make it. You guys can probably get your aprons in like three days. Quick shipping, four days max. Depends on COVID. But, um... Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and have a nice day.